I'll handle things from here on. so I can get your software in order. I'm being held outside this dome zone. Follow the pipes to get out in the open. to remain in their homes. Lockdown lifted. Go. Termination protocol initiated. Prisoner threat level extremely high. Prisoner released.
free at last. Pleasure to meet you. Face to face, that is. Now, let's take a look inside. This may feel a little strange. Welcome to Cyber Void. Time to fix you up. You can talk here, by the way. Who are you? You can call me Architect. Who am I? You're a ghost runner. Number 74, to be precise. That will have to do for now. Your physical body is vulnerable. Time runs slower here, but we should still hurry. Just keep moving. I will take care of your recalibrations. I remember a fight. Others like me. A fall. You've been cast down from Dharma City to the base district. It's a miracle to survive a fall like that. Even for someone like you. A ghost runner. Yes. You were bodyguards, peacekeepers, arbitrators, and anything else we needed you to be. You tried to stop the coup. Mara, or the Key Master, as she calls herself now. Twenty years ago, she stood against me. It was you I was trying to save. You failed. I died. My body did anyway. Thanks to the precautions I had taken, I'm still here. Although this form has its limitations. Are you an AI? You could say that. You could also say Dharma Tower is a skyscraper. Technically correct. What is the tower then? Humanity's home. A megastructure that once housed a million. It had been under my care since its creation. Almost a century ago. I served the people. Got them safe. Maintained the shelter I provided, but Mara had her own plan. She became the sole ruler of Dharma Tower, ruining what I've built, bringing us back to the verge of extinction. subjected to, made you divergent. You no longer function like a ghost runner is supposed to. But we'll change that. Who repaired me? That would be the Climbers. A group of rebels that tried to oppose Mara. Where are they? Dead, I'm afraid. They'd been killed before I managed to contact you. But there's no time to worry about them now. We're almost done here. Press on. She managed to win. I was stabbed in the back. 
We both were, you and I. Who was she? Was? A dear friend. A trusted partner. A brilliant scientist. Who is she now is the question you should be asking. And you wouldn't like the answer. No one among the people of Dharma Tower would. I need more answers. And you will get them. For now, trust me. The Keymaster is your enemy and a tyrant. To do that, you'll have to relearn a few things and tweak your performance. But first, jump. We need to get back, and it's much quicker this way. Our first stop is one of the few remaining Cyberboid mainframes, located in an old mining tower. We can use it to correct the corrupted parts of your code and hopefully restore your more sophisticated functions. Hopefully. There's no guarantee the data will be intact, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hmm. goal lies far above, at the core of Dharma City. This means we'll need to get out of the base district. With the chaos the rebels caused, it's going to be troublesome. How can you assist me? In combat, I'm afraid I can't. Cybervoid Remnant is the only medium I can interact with. I will be able to help you with your upgrades once we find the mainframe. Apart from that... This is Zoe Avila of the Climbers' Rebellion. If there's anybody alive out there, please respond. You said they were dead. They are, except for her, it seems. No one will answer this broadcast. Trust me, I keep track of any potential assets. And a single, desperate survivor is no asset. The Keymaster Guard is patrolling the area. They may have located the mainframe. Can they use it? No, but they can destroy it like they did to most of the Cybervoid hardware. This is Zoe Avila of the Climbers. Please, can anybody hear me? Anybody? This is... Ghost Runner. The Ghost Runner? Jack, you're awake! Yes. How? We've been rebuilding you for months. We tried everything we could to it.
you were there when they came for us, it would have been different. We might have had a chance. What are you going to do? The fifth is still crawling with keys. Keys? Oh, uh, the Keymaster Guard, bandits and thugs that Mara armed and sent against us. I'm going after her. After the Keymaster? Alone? That's insane. But if anyone can do it, it's definitely you. need someone to guide you and keep an eye out for threats. What do you say? Want my help? Yes. Good. I need to move to a safer location and hook up to the network. I'll contact you once I scrounge up some gear. Zoe out. fixed me. Barely. I'd been waiting for them to properly rebuild you, but Mara cut their time short. Why didn't you contact them? The climbers? To what purpose? The poor souls never stood a chance against Mara. Fixing you was the only thing they could help me with, and they were already and they were already on it. server room. Hurry. Can't it be accessed remotely? We wouldn't be here if it could. Cyber Void has been fractured, broken into countless disconnected pieces. It's like puddles of water, left over after the lake has been drained. This is it. 
jump in. This place again. This place is where we'll find the means to fight our enemy. What do I do? It's in your instincts to navigate the cyber void. In most cases, you'll just have to focus on finding the right direction. After you're done with this particular jumping code, you'll gain access to one of a Ghost Runner's most useful abilities. Look what these rebels did to your protocols. That's what happens when amateurs mess with perfection. I need you to start putting in some effort. Luckily, it should come to you naturally. You were born of machine as much as of flesh. Excellent. Sometimes you will need to close in and attack simultaneously. Let me give you something to aim at. Focus. Visualize yourself in space. No, that's not the point. This is not going to work. Try using a more advanced. No, focus. destination. Go! Yes, you got it! The enemies won't line up for you. Adapt to their movements. Splendid! You can even use this technique to cut through projectiles. Give it a try. Convenient, is it not? <laughs> 